So what's the deal with Italian coffee and cappuccino? Big deal, big deal. We're two Italian sisters living in Italy. I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about how we eat, drink, and enjoy life. But before we, we, we go on, we should adjust our languages. <laughs> you, I'm sure you're thinking about coffee. But what, when we talk about coffee, wait. <laughs> this is coffee to us, okay? And in this, depending where you are, you probably have this much coffee. <laughs> okay, so this is, this is the expectation. I mean, you have expectations, this is the reality. So it's very, very different. This is what coffee in Italy looks like, okay? So now we're gonna, we're gonna continue, but always keep this in mind. <laughs> True. Which is true. So first of all, in Italy, you have coffee in a bar. That is what is where we have coffee in un bar. That's so if name. you see bar, that's that's where you go have coffee. Because it's it literally means cafe. That's what it is, bar. And when when do we have coffee? So we have coffee throughout the day, and every we have various coffees throughout the day because being so big, you need more than one. <laughs> we don't we don't go around with coffees. No, so we so we usually have one to start our morning, mm -hmm. and usually the like the first one that you start your morning, you go and you you can have a cafe, you can have a cappuccino, and oh, usually this is a hot topic. And cappuccino usually, spicy, <laughs> <laughs> and usually like something to eat. If, a lot of people actually in Italy, a lot of people enjoy like so. my son really loves to have. Colazione al bar. Colazione al bar, yeah. Breakfast at, at the cafe. I used to do that too, but now I, I enjoy having it at home. But you have a cornetto, Italians eat a sweet breakfast, and so you have a cappuccino, cornetto, uh, with a coffee al bar. And that's morning. That's morning. But what is, if you go and you ask for a cafe, a coffee, oh, of course. we have different types of coffee that you can choose from. Always that same size of coffee. With very easy names. Yes. But that need a little bit of explanation. So if you just ask for a coffee, they will give you a just plain cafe espresso. Espresso. Un cafe espresso. Espresso means fast. And that will be the base of your coffee. So if you ask for a coffee, they're just going to give you a black little coffee. If you want to add some milk, you can ask for a macchiato. But macchiato is is a stain. It's uh, una macchia is, is a stain. So macchiato, you are staining. It's still going to be in, within this cup. Oh, yes. So the stain of milk, macchiato caldo. Everything happens here. Yeah, they're <laughs> not going to change a cup no. and give you a, another one. No, only so, if you ask for an Americano. Then in that case, you get a bigger cup. But if not, this is what you're getting. Yeah, but we're having coffee as Italians do. Italians, uh, usually, this is what we have. So. Café, they're going to give you a, just a plain black coffee. Café macchiato, you can ask for macchiato caldo if you want it with hot milk or macchiato freddo if you want it with cold milk. You can ask it with the foam. You can ask it with the foam, like I love to have it. And we call it schiumato. So they make the foam like the foam that you use for cappuccino and then they, 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 they put it inside. So it's a little... Little mini cappuccino. Because schiuma means foam. Schiuma means foam. Then you can have. Well, th these are the main ones. These are the main breakfast ones, yes. Yeah. And if you order cappuccino, you know, cappuccino for it's, breakfast is fine. Cappuccino. Except, Benny, please continue. Allora, now this is, this is, this is, this is big. This is very, very big. And just so you know, then obviously you can do whatever you want. But just so that you know that if you order a cappuccino after. Okay, let's be flexible. Let's give them until noon which is already late, let's say 11, let's be 11-ish, it is very frowned upon. We, so cappuccino is something that you have for breakfast because it's milk. Milk is a meal that you have only at breakfast. You never, ever, ever, ever order a cappuccino after lunch, during lunch. I mean, I have seen things that would horrify anybody. So you don't. I mean, I've had people eating pizza with a cappuccino. I've seen people having carbonara with a cappuccino. No. But why? The why? reason is because, because milk for us is a meal. Yes. And also, we do pay attention a lot to 
the, the flavor, the ingredients of the foods that we are eating, mm -hmm. and they don't pair. No. So if you have milk with a tomato sauce, or it, 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 just, it just does not get along. You know, you pair wine during a meal, you can add extra virgin olive oil, you pair no. other things, but not milk. No. No. Okay, so even, well, during a meal, they will, they will obviously bring you whatever, most people will bring you what you ask others, I've, 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 I've seen. No, I've not, they, no, no, because, it, because it's, they refuse, so the other day I was having, um, I was having lunch, I was at the Jewish ghetto and it was late, it was maybe around two o'clock, and uh, these, this, these tourists, clearly tourists, sit down and they order two big pasta dishes with the cappuccino, and the, the face of the waiter was just like, he's like, no. And, and they're like, no? They're like, no. He's like, no. And they're like, please. He's like, no. He did bring it to them. They obviously complained once he left, but no. Because no. again, you guys, you are traveling to Italy, okay? You may have your ways of doing things. That, nobody's saying never to do them again, but when you come to Italy, yeah. you have to get into our culture if you want to really live the authentic experience, okay? So you will see people just like look at you like saying, please, please, mm -hmm. no, please undo that sentence. Sure. <laughs> and sure. you don't for that reason, because it interferes with the flavor because of the dish. Because we care, we care, yes. because we Actually, care. No, because we I, do I've care. had a friend of mine um, from school say, you know, uh, I went to this restaurant and I asked for parmigiano on top sure. of, my, of my pasta with, with fish. And I, and he said, no, it was so rude. And I said, you know, that's actually very nice that he did. You should be very grateful. You should be very grateful because there are cer certain things that Italians do not do. So if you want to have the Italian experience, you need to understand why. It's not that it's just like this idea that we have. No. Because if you're having, if you're actually having an experience with food, you can't take away the flavor of the food because you're drinking coffee. No. Okay, so that is why no milk, no cappuccino during or after the main meals, which is lunch or dinner. What you do instead is have, you have coffee. coffee. And if you really, really, after really want meal. milk, you can add, you can macchiare, but that doesn't count because that's literally two drops of milk. Yeah. And then I would say that this closes lunch. Well, we talked about lunch and dinner sort of See, let's, are similar. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But for instance, whenever you um, you go to a bar, to a bar to have coffee, regardless what time of the day it is, you should know that we we um, have those at the counter. Ah uh, yes, how how we drink coffee? That's that's a very good point, which is totally different. That is how you usually have it. So yeah. you just go. I mean, again, you walk in, you look pay. at this. How how long could it ever take to? to finish this so this is why you go to the counter coffees are approximately like a euro between one and 150 yeah let's say okay so you go to the counter you you can you can take three sips like four if you really want to take your time <laughs> <laughs> but then there's not there's a four <laughs> four sips I'm gonna, next time i have a cup i'm gonna count it or if not you could choose to sit at the tables but you should know that Service will be included. Yeah, service, so yeah, from so from good. one one euro fifty, it could get to three four, depending if you're sitting at a piazza, it could get to it could yeah, very expensive. Exactly. But there are two different prices. But if you want to do it the Italian way, you stand. You stand it, and you sort of have to battle with the people next to you to <laughs> get true. to the counter, and then people make space so people drink quickly so that the people behind. So it's 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 a yeah, mission. Yeah, that's true. But that's part it, of that's the experience. A very, it's a something that nice that we do because, you know, if you're taking too much time to drink your coffee or no, people cappuccino... No, will, people will make it clear. But you know, you sort of feel guilty, so you will um, you will have it and go. And, um, and now another thing about having coffee, something that we do not do is we do not do takeaway. You will never ah, see an Italian right. walking around with two liters of coffee inside a... a, a, a Jug, jug, mug, or whatever. No, we don't do that. Our coffee is espresso. It lasts very a very pleasurable five minutes at the most, and then basta. You'll never see us drinking this coffee throughout the entire day. It's not part of what we do. It's not part of our culture. And, and we don't but do this that. is this just came to it just popped up in my mind. 
Do you agree that Italians don't eat and drink all day long? No, we don't. We don't. You know, we have breakfast. You may have a little snack. But it, it's yeah. on, off, on, off. We don't Same. go around drinking and sipping and no, that don't. you could take hours to drink your coffee. No, we don't do that. It's, no, you know, that's, that's, and, and, no, we don't. We have coffee. We have morning breakfast. And coffee then in the afternoon. we stop eating and we stop, like, we stop eating. But every moment we really, really enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> and then, yes, you have that moment, that three minute, four sips of coffee. But you're like really in the pleasant. It's just like, ah. Oh, and yeah. then that's it. But you... you and it's a moment of mindfulness. We throw ourselves completely into that moment and basta. We enjoy that and then we just move on. And, and, and so, yeah, that's a very good point. So, yeah, we, do, we, don't, we don't do takeaway. We don't do takeaway. And um, something you were telling me the other day that you often, I have never asked, been asked this question about iced coffee. Yes, what's the thing with iced coffee? Like, you Italians don't drink iced coffee. First of all, it's rare that we have ice. I think this is the first year ever that you actually find ice at the supermarket. Ice, you could, we use like more in cocktails, but, but I, no, we don't have ice. Don't. And I'm sure that if you, if, if no, you come to Italy or if you have already done, had that experience that you're ice. like, why does like my Coke not have ice? We don't use we don't, ice. No. no, we don't put ice in what we don't, we don't, we're not ice people. We put a lot of ice in spirits, but that's a whole different other subject. What you may have, and if you ask, ice coffee. We don't. I don't even. I can't even imagine what this, an ice no, coffee. No, but I said like. it's ice, like ice with coffee. Okay. But we don't do that. If you want that, we can. When in summer, we have something that's called caffè freddo, and that practically is coffee, espresso that is put in a bottle, is put in the fridge, and so when you want it, they give it to you. <laughs> But maybe instead of something like this, they put a little a glass. Little bit more because, and a it's little already bit and it already has sugar. It's already has sugar, so that's our cafe food. So no, we don't we don't do iced <laughs> coffee. That's so funny, but it's true. And another thing, oh, yesterday I was having breakfast with um, a family of of, of non Italian people, and the look on the face when she asked for a latte. <laughs> E latte. 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 Cioè, quando, perché when you order a, a, a latte, they, they bring you something else. And I said, un caffè latte, it, and they just brought a glass of milk. <laughs> because um, in, in the US, you use Italian <laughs> words, which actually have turned into a different, a different meaning compared oh. to here. So, the look on people's face. What's a latte? A latte is, I don't know exactly what a latte is in Starbucks, but it, it, it's not a glass of milk. <laughs> <laughs> and so she was, and she's like, but why is it in a glass? And I said, because that's how we drink the milk. <laughs> it's actually in like a, in a glass that you would the probably have like water. A, yes. <laughs> and it's <laughs> funny because you see, when we say it's cultural, that's why we're here sitting on our sofa and having this conversation with you because we have noticed that things that, that you have certain expectations. That's sure. why it was important to show you what we're talking about that's when it comes to coffee. If not, we're talking two different languages yeah. and it should be that way. But then when you come to Italy, then you think that we're rude, that we are... That we don't understand. That we don't understand, that we, you... That we, you ordered they gave you a different thing when you actually ordered what in our language means that and that's yeah. why I, I love having these conversations it was so funny this has nothing to do with coffee but the same happened once I, I did this I was doing this cooking class and this this lady came she was very upset she goes I went to a restaurant the other day and I was just so upset I ordered pizza with pepperoni and they bought pizza with bell peppers and I said well, because that's what pepperoni are you expect pepperoni them to be pepperoni. or bell peppers in Italian. Yeah, and you expect them to be sausages. So yes, so but latte, I, that's so funny. Because I, I, I don't know what, what I really. I, if I were to order a latte in the states, I would not know what to what to expect. It's, so it's I'm not. It's not a. It's, it's not, not a glass, glass of milk. milk. <laughs> <laughs> that's cute. It's it's cute because it's just like you see the obviously the people's face are just like <laughs> why because <laughs> that's what you ordered. <laughs> And that's, and that's why, that's how, that's the big deal behind how Italians drink, how and when Italians how, drink yeah, how, yeah. the coffee and the cappuccino, which is a big deal, big. And, and now you know. Now you know. 
And by the way, in the comments below, first of all, if you had any of these experiences, I, I would love to know about them. And then if you want to know more, if we didn't cover something that you have a question about, about coffee and things like that, ask us. Ask us. We will answer. We will answer, of course, again.